Finally, V-Day Mountain Bikes, City Bikes, or Motorized Bicycles, the two-wheel contraption invented in the early 1800s has come a long way. But one company is taking this mode of transport even further by reinventing the wheel, quite literally. Our leading town looks at what this new wheel could mean for the future of transportation. Imagine a wheel that thinks and works for you, then retrofit that to any old bike, and there you have it. A climate-friendlier electric hybrid bicycle made for the 21st century. And Super Pedestrian in Cambridge, Massachusetts, a company with roots at MIT and financial backing from Copenhagen, Denmark, is making that a reality. The Copenhagen wheel can go on practically any bicycle. It contains within its red hub a motor, batteries, and a control system and a few uh, sensors. The wheel is wireless and connected to an app on the cyclist's smartphone via Bluetooth. When you are going uphill, it will give you a stronger boost. And then when you go downhill, it will resist you. And by resisting you, it goes to regen and it regenerates your battery. The Copenhagen wheel is the brainchild of Super Pedestrian's founder and CEO Asaf Biderman, who wants to take a cycling culture already ubiquitous in cities like Copenhagen even further. This is the main idea behind the Copenhagen wheel. How can we get to work not drenched in sweat? How can you ride from the suburb into the city and make it a manageable ride? Something that feels like you know, you're riding two, three miles, but actually have it be a 10, 15 mile ride. The idea was conceived in an MIT lab. Growing interest later propelled Bitterman to license the technology and start up his company and bring his wheel to market. Think of the slightly uh, lower density urban areas. If these could become connected to downtown via bicycles, we're looking at a dramatic change in the quality of living. To get a feel for the wheel, I decided to give it a test ride. So I'm getting a little bit hands-on, doing a little bit of a leg work, and checking for traffic, and here we go. So when I start pedaling, I can feel the wheel kick in and maintain the momentum. So all I really need to do is pedal once or twice perhaps and then it just maintains the speed the wheel sells for 800 US dollars pricey by some estimates but if it does take off it could go the distance in more ways than one Leelington CCTV Cambridge Massachusetts